Hey guys, welcome to Coding Simplified and today we are going to start a series on basic coding problems where we will solve the basic problems. So our first problem is that to get the factorial of any given number. I know it's a very easy problem but to start with the first tutorial, uh, let's start with it and later we'll see some more problems. So if you see the definition of factorial is that any number so let's say if you want to calculate the factorial of 5 so you need to multiply it till 1 if you decrease the value by 1 so that is the factorial for example if it is 5 then you need to multiply 5 then 4 then 3 then 2 and then 1 it means the product of all positive integers less than or equals to n so that is the factorial of that value so what is the factorial of 3 that is 3 into 2 into 1 which is 6 factorial of 4 24 right so whatever the value you want to calculate the factorial of means product of all positive integers less than that value so how will solve this problem so first of all I have uh, this recursion so using recursion we can do in very easily so what I will do I will pass here the fact so this is my effect function uh, so i will pass the factorial uh, the n and i will say if n equals to 1 then return 1 else recursively call the fact n minus 1 so what it will do let's say okay so let's see we are debug it will debug it and so here my n is 5 so it will do n means 5 into fact 4 now again n is 4 so n is not 1 so it will say now 4 into 3 now 3 into 2 now 2 into 1 so when it will say n equals to 1 so it will return 1 it means cumulatively it will return you so it will return you 120 which is the correct answer right so this is uh, how we have done using a recursion but now let's say you don't want to do using recursion you want to do by using for loop so what we can do um, for this I have written another function which is factorial so here what I am doing basically I am passing my again the n value so I am saying fact equals to 1 and iterate this loop from i equals to i less than n and multiply fact equals to fact into i so what it will do it will start from the 1 so it will multiply 1 into 1 then factorial 1 so again now 1 into 2 now 2 into 3 3 into 4 right so so fact will increase fact will have the updated value and it will it will multiply the value by i right and at the end when i will be equals to 1 oh sorry n so it will return you the factorial which is fact so if you debug this value here so you can see that fact equals to 1 so it will run this value till i less than n and then at the last it will return factorial which is 120 so that's it guys for this video we have seen how to get the factorial using recursion as well as using for loop and in next tutorials we will see some more problems so so guys please like the video and please subscribe the channel for more such videos thank you